Hi, I'm Alex from Gigabyte. I'm product manager, and here you are seeing is the, our latest uh, Gigabyte standable solution. You can see it is one of the Ultra Turbo 5 family. It uses the IR 13, uh, 3550 power stage. It provides a, a necessary power to the CPU, so you can do some heavy CPU tasks. And also, we are uh, soundable two ports. You can chain up to 12 devices, and each port has a 10 gigabit per second bandwidth. There's no interference uh, on each other. You can do some serious video editing, uh, which the screen uh, next, uh, behind me. Here you can see now, uh, this is a Sumitomo optical cable. The connection is uh, our host. Through this optic link, to this call digit T2, it's a, it has a two SSDs inside, and this is a T1. It's also a part of the daisy chain, so we are chaining up two devices. The Adobe Premiere, you can see now. Here are three video streams. Uh, they are all full HD, uh, 19, uh, 1920 times 1080p. And one thing important for uh, video editing is that uh, the editor need to. See the frame. Uh, see the video frame by frame, like this one. Uh, let me show you about the uh, bandwidth on the soundboard compares to the onboard storage. Uh, you can see now the screen is quite clean. It has only one video clip. It's uh, the same, full HD, uh, 19, 1980, uh, 1920 times 1080p. You can start. You, you can see that video keeps lagging. It's not as smooth as we put the footage on the CalDigit T2 storage. With this kind of experience, the editor cannot do anything because it's just, just lagging. The frame drops by frame. And one thing you need to mention is that the Blackmagic design is a Canadian, uh, Canadian maker. Uh, they are very good at the video capturing. Uh, these two devices, they have a codec inside, so you can do a real-time video shooting has a video input to this box, do real-time encoding, and storage. You may storage on the CalDigit, Arika or Promise, whatever, and then you can do real-time editing to add subtitles, to add some videos, add some another layer, add some uh, vocals, whatever, if you like. Uh, on the comparison with uh, CalDigit and local storage, you can see the bandwidth difference between the SATA and the Soundable 10 gig. It's very good for the video editing for home users from uh, some professional studio video ma makers.